sun, bright sun, I'm gonna melt. Good morning, neighborhood community. I got little reindeers on my head this morning. Yeah. Right off the red nose reindeer. Anyway, there's Kevin. Hello. 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 Hello, chap. Hello, old chap. Young chap. Car's coming. Anyway, he is taking me over to Kirstie's house. It's early. It's about 10 o'clock in the morning. But we have to go to the ranch because the vet is coming to the ranch <laughs> um, to take out Paloma's stitches today. So we have to be at the ranch early this morning um, so that we can do that. And then I am going to hang out at Kirstie's house again today. No gymnastics, though. No, I'm still sore from all the exercise I get hanging out with Kirstie. So, no gymnastics. Coloring today. I want to get some Christmas stuff colored. Um, nobody's really answered me about um, the Christmas cards. I got two people who responded. One said no. One said that was a good idea. So, um, Pete and Sue Price, you guys are going to be getting one. Um, I'm pretty sure I have your address. So, I think you guys are guys are okay and you guys will be getting one so either Pete or Sue or a little bit of both of you need to finish coloring the card and then send me a picture of it so there you have it um, but anybody else who's interested you got to let me know because I would love to send you guys a half colored Christmas card <laughs> not that I'm lazy or anything no <laughs> But I am coloring Christmas pictures. I will be showing them um, shortly. And um, they will be going up for um, donations. So once I show you guys those, if anybody's interested, um, you can have one of the Christmas pictures that I'm coloring for a small donation. <sighs> what are you going to do today, baby cakes? I've got to call some prospective clients see if I can get some more drummed up and um, I will be putting Halloween stuff away trying to clear the front room we worked so hard yesterday or was it the day before to get enough money in our account to get our water turned back on and we did that and we had about $90 left in our account and this morning we're overdrawn again because his health insurance came out. Yep. So if it's not one thing, it's another. So now we gotta scramble around to get enough money to cover the overdraw that we have now for the health insurance. All right, so I have a little job today with one of my favorite customers. She's always very happy with the work I do, which makes me happy. You know how that is. Um, the jobs are not coming in the way they should be. Home Advisor, I know I have talked about them before. If you are looking for uh, some, some work done, Home Advisor is great. They've got a great business going on for themselves. However, if you are a uh, someone on the other side that the uh, professional uh, worker they send you leads which is great they charge you per lead and it's not cheap it's between uh, $18 and $27 a lead and um, you have, there's no guarantee that you're going to get the job because they you're not the only one they send the lead to they send to at least three other people Okay guys, so we just finished at the ranch. We didn't film anything um, it was this so morning. Fast. Yeah, we actually could have filmed a little bit, but we didn't but really we... think about it. Yeah. Um, I groomed Paloma. Um, I usually don't groom Paloma um, because of him healing, but he's all healed up right now. He looks really, really good, guys. Um, so, but I groomed Paloma today and I walked Paloma a little bit before the vet got there. We could have filmed some of that, but we really just didn't think about it because we were just so 
we were we were I was learning with Paloma yes so we were more concentrating on that and then the vet got there and then we put Paloma away and now we're gonna go grab something to eat and then we're gonna head back to Kirstie's house and hang out there she got clean oh dolls. and oh my gosh Megan sent us pictures today I'll let Kirstie tell you about that oh my gosh she sent us pictures of the two big huge like trucks and trailers for the Budweiser Clydesdales and I love the Budweiser Clydesdales and I am just really jealous about the whole situation. So. And she did send us a picture of one of the Clydesdales. She's going to send us some video later. <sighs> and I they're, want one. <laughs> they're at her college right now. And um, they wanted to, um, what did she say? They wanted to rebuild all and of their stables and stalls exactly. and all of that. And, and store um, them, there, not store them, but have them there for at least two weeks out of a year. Yeah. And their like co her year. college said no. Like, how do you say no to that? Seriously. It was crazy. I mean, wow. Radio, rodeo Cafe. All right, so we're at the Rodeo Cafe right now here in Norco. Um, there it is right there, guys. If you guys ever want to um, find a place to have some good grub, um, this is excellent food. We ate here the day we took Paloma to the vet, which is right next door here. Yes. And they had excellent food. Excellent day food. Look at the toy soldier, guys. He's all dressed up for Christmas. So we're going to go around the corner here and we'll get to see more of it. Woo! They got a big minion. Hey everybody! So we're finally back at my house. We, what all did we do? We went to the ranch. We went to the ranch to get the sutures taken out. Mm -hmm. And also went to, to get his first autoimmune uh vaccine right and i got him out of the stall no yep. i groomed him yep. i walked him around and i held the tail while the vet was taking the sutures out yep i put him back in his stall yep and then we went for breakfast at rodeo cafe and it was delicious lots of food mm. yes too much food you know how i always <laughs> love betty face uh -huh. this place gives betty face a run for their money uh oh Yep. This is true. Yeah, they do. So anyway, um, and then we went oh, to we're... Winco. Oh yeah, we went to Winco. Yeah. Had to get some carrots for the boys. So. And then we just been these. back at the house coloring and uh, <coughs> pantsing Kirsty. In my front yard. <laughs> you guys are so mean to me. She had her foot right here, and I turned, and she kicked me in the face. No. So she deserved it. You hit yourself in the face with my foot that just coincidentally just was there. <laughs> yep. We didn't videotape that because this is a family-friendly channel. Yeah. Well, maybe some of the neighbors did. <laughs> the neighbors across my neighbors the street, across the street have cameras, system. and they have, like, a lot, and they do see my house. So. <laughs> It'll be forever ingrained in their memories. <laughs> you doing, silly girl. But hey, maybe maybe I'll become like rich because maybe I'll go viral on the internet or something. You never know. So anyway, we're headed back over to the ranch um, to feed and do work some other Gabulon. stuff. Work and groom Gabulon, and then uh, you're walking Paloma. Okay, that's what we're doing. Yep. And we're gonna take some more pictures. Yes. Gonna take some more pictures. Yes, that is still a work in progress. That whole ranch and 
you know, yeah. thing. So, anyway, we're going to call it an evening. We hope you enjoyed a little bit of something that you may have seen in our video today. If you did, please give us a favorite, give us a thumbs up, leave us a comment down below, share our video with your family and friends, but most of all, please subscribe. Ha, ha, ha.